just woke up and I need to get ready. So let's go. Jessica. Now for this video, I will be sharing my learnings on school librarianship as well as my insight or knowledge that I think might be helpful to you whether you're currently a library and information science student or a bliss student or you want to be a school librarian or lastly you're already a school librarian who just wants the perception of a bliss student so without further ado sit back get your cup of coffee and let's talk about school librarianship As a child, I've always been surrounded by books. Books, books, and tons and tons of books. And I know how helpful those books to me. As I was growing up, I wouldn't be taking library and information science right now if I wasn't surrounded by those books. Hence, I know how important it is for children all over the world to have access to those kind of books. We all know that children are filled with curiosity, as was I when I was a child. Hence, it is important for children to be able to find the information that they need or for their personal and educational needs. That's why we need the school library. Hence, we need a space, a haven, or an instrument for the children's quality learning and education. And that is the, the school library. The school library along with the school librarian, the one who manages the school library, is the key that allows the students as well as the teachers to carry out classroom learning activities. And also to carry out their personal interests. Since children don't only need to focus on their academics, but they also have their own hobbies and personal interests. Now from that, we can gather that school library brings service. Now is it wrong for us to consider the school library as a service agency? For me, I see the school library as a service agency. And I see the school librarian as an agent for change. Hmm. Now why change? Well, in a way, the school library basically shapes you and nurtures you as you grow. Well, not grow in the literal sense, cause if the school library does make you grow, why am I still below 5 feet? Now, there are so many things I have gathered from school libraries. From its definition, nature and characteristics, history, roles of school libraries in education, its historical development, the school libraries in the Philippines, its programs and services, administration of school libraries, and the standards. Now, what do I think of all of these? Of course, all of these are very crucial. These are all very helpful knowledge and information that will help you or that will guide you into knowing and understanding school librarianship. Now, you might ask, why do I need the school library? I have Google, I have the public library. School librarians know how to match books. Not match people. And resources for the current curriculum needs of your school. They know where the best resources are and they know how to teach and how to teach teachers. So yes, school libraries are a central point to bring together pedagogy and resources aligned to students' needs. School librarians teach students about information literacy, digital responsibility, and also a lifelong love of reading. I believe that every school should have a library. Every student should have access to the library and have the opportunity to go there. The skills that students develop in the school library will continue to serve them far beyond the classroom.
Well, I rambled quite a lot. But I hope that this helped you learn more about school librarianship or this might have inspired you to become a school librarian yourself. Now, I want to ask you, do you think that there should be a library in every school? I would love to hear what you think in the comment section below. That would be all for today. I'm also getting quite hungry. See you in the next video. Bye!